Like all Powermatic machines, the 719T is made out of several heavy-duty iron castings. They're machined well and they're going to last a very long time. Like the X and Y motion in the table, the power head slides on dovetailed keyways. All of the dovetailed slides are equipped with Gibbs screw adjusters let you dial out any wear that may develop over the years. They also let you fine tune the feel of how much drag there is when you move the piece up and down. The solid steel operating arm is mounted to a cast iron hub that's attached to the pinion shaft. It's spring loaded so you can pull it out and reposition it on the shaft so you can get the best most comfortable stroke for the job. Mortis depth is controlled by this tool free stop rod. You notice that the stop rod is located directly behind the keyways. This prevents the cutter head from torquing over when the stop rod contacts its base at the bottom of the stroke. That means cleaner mortises and your bits stay sharper longer. The truck is mounted directly to the motor shaft as the machine comes from the factory. And that'll accommodate most chisels. However, if you have chisels with short shanks, they include a truck extender to accommodate those and there's a swing open door on either side of the power head for access to the truck. Mounting the chisels into the machine is very easy and it's pretty conventional. They use a set of bushings to accommodate the different chisel sizes and they give you three bushings with the machine. The side to side and front to back motions at a table are controlled by these five inch diameter hand wheels. This one moves the table side to side, this one moves it front to back. If you need to make more than one mortise of the same size, you can position these slip collars and then tighten them down to limit the table travel to the left and right. Probably the most eye-catching feature on a machine is the tilting table. Now it pivots on a single hinge on that side and it has these guide bars on this end tighten and loosen with the included wrench. You just loosen this bolt, tilt the table to the setting you want and tighten it up. The Front to back and side to side functions continue to work with the table tilted. This material stop is also included and is fully adjustable without tools. Plus you can install this on either end of the fence. A very nice feature on this machine is this clamping system. It has a large cast iron fence that has holes in it already so you can attach an auxiliary fence if that need be. But it's got special threads that let you just push the face up against the work and then turn it and it locks down. Another nice feature is if you're working with angled or odd shaped pieces you can loosen the mounting bolts on the clamp head and it will pivot on its head. Naturally the important thing is how well the 719T cuts mortises and I think you'll be very impressed with that. If you're looking to buy a mortiser, consider the Powermatic 719T. This is a very capable machine, it's very well made, and has a lot of good design ideas that make it very easy to use and very accurate.